uh, good Monday morning. It's the 20th day of June. And yes, today is the last day of spring. Yeah, it's the last day of Gemini season too. So yes, a happy birthday to Lionel Richie, of course, from the Commodores, also to Brian Wilson of the Beach Boys, also to Bob Vila as well, and also a happy birthday going out to uh, John Goodman, and also to Rob McCoviak and Paul Bacco, and to Kendrys Morales as well. Well, yes, it was a tough loss for the Dodgers yesterday as they lose 5-3 to three to the Guardians. And they finish 3-2 and two on the homestand. But yes, the good news is that the Angels beat the Mariners 4 out of 5. And Mike Trout just keeps hitting those game-winning home runs that decide the game or break the tie. Or that put the Angels ahead. Yeah, so... That was good for the Angels, but the Angels are coming home for a long homestand as they host the Kansas City Royals for three. And then the Mariners come next weekend. And for the Dodgers, they're off today. And yes, we do need a day off here and there. And yeah, the Dodgers will go on a road trip to Cincinnati. Then they head to Atlanta to take on the defending champs. And then they take on the uh, Rockies up in Denver. And meanwhile, today is game three of the Stanley Cup Finals between the uh, Colorado Avalanche and the Tampa Bay Lightning as the series shifts to Florida, where Tampa Bay's been pretty good at home. And we'll, we'll find out if the Lightning get on the board or if the Avalanche take a commanding lead, but we'll see what happens later. And today the Golden State Warriors had their victory parade up in the streets of San Francisco down Market Street. And yes, it is the end of the NBA season, as we all know. And yes, teams that make it to the NBA Finals have the shortest off season than, te than teams that don't even make the playoffs. So teams that miss the playoffs have a longer vacation and teams that get to the playoffs or the finals don't have a long vacation. And that's why it's so hard to repeat, you know. Your summer vacation is not long enough and then you gotta go to training camp and then start all over in October. And we know four months from now, we'll see if the Lakers can turn things around with our new coach, Darvin Ham. And well, the Clippers though, on the other hand, well, we don't know. Well, also a happy birthday to the late Eric Dolphy as well, who would have been 94 years old today. And uh, yes, it's gonna be much warmer today as well with temperatures in the lower 80s. It was only in the mid 70s yesterday, which was perfect. Yeah, the final weekend of spring had really nice weather. But, but once, yep. Yeah. And now we're on the last day of spring. And then tomorrow, of course, is the summer solstice meaning that it's gonna be the longest day of the year here, here in, in the US. Yeah, that means up near, up near Alaska, you know, you have that midnight sun. And yeah, up, up in like Seattle, Washington, it doesn't get dark until like nine o'clock. Yeah, it stays light pretty late up there. And Yeah, well, all right. Well, have a good rest of your Monday. I'll catch you later. Amen.